everybody that is somebody. So if you ain't nobody, I ain't talking to you. <laughs> Hello, what up, what's up? I'm Misha, and this is Misha C. Tarot. All praises due to the most high. I truly appreciate you, and I thank you for joining me. And if you haven't already, you know what to do. Boo, hit the button, hit the button, as well as the like button if this resonates with you or you enjoy the content. I'm not going to hold you. We're going to go ahead and jump right into this. God, I thank you. Jesus, I thank you. Angels and ancestors of the Most High, with your white light, please guide and protect us as we go into the tarot and allow me to channel clear. I don't know why that, them two little pieces of napkin is irritating me. <laughs> please guide and protect us as we go into the tarot and allow me to channel clear and honest messages. Ancestors, I thank you. Spirit guides, I thank you. Please don't allow any interference with this message, any negativity. Or evil intent. Clear and honest messages for the collective. I was guided to say that. Something is rotten or rotting. You need to throw it out. Clean your refrigerator. Or your cabinets. Or your cubby. Or your pantry. Clear and honest messages, Holy Spirit. For the collective. Something is very significant about LA as well. This could be like the, the, the hot spots. I'm getting like LA, Miami, Atlanta, okay? I don't know why I just heard Philadelphia. Clearing on this messages for the collective, Holy Spirit. Clearing on this messages. You have here a change. Okay, so something is going to be like a whole new lifestyle for somebody. Mm, somebody could definitely be a. Um, doing some shadow work here i feel like ain't nobody going with you it's just gonna be you and your shadow <laughs> oh my gosh the letter m could be significant as well as the letter p and g okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i feel like somebody's packing up their things they're leaving they're going all right somebody can also play a musical instrument this could be the piano the saxophone a guitar somebody plays a musical instrument here okay i'm also getting like Somebody's luggage could have gotten lost or I don't know, something going on with somebody's luggage. Something with baggage claim, all right? Somebody could also have a new car. You could be traveling by car. Wow, we also have your journey at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, somebody is definitely taking a um taking charge of a situation and going on a journey adventure or some type of traveling okay this could be short travel or long distance tell me more holy spirit clearing on this messages we have here high honor wow something could be bought and paid for and they're just waiting for your arrival you could have a new offer a new offer a new job position somebody could also be moving for work you could be yeah i feel like the official person is going to show their stuff very soon with journey once again at the bottom of the deck i'm gonna go ahead and, and lead that to the side all right Somebody could also be meeting a potential partner on this trip, or they could be moving towards a partner. Somebody's divine masculine or divine feminine is there waiting on their arrival. I'm getting the letter O or O's. O's and O's? I don't know. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. X's and O's. Clearing on this messages, Holy Spirit. One more message. Change, high honor. Damn, that was a lot. Somebody could have went through poverty or homelessness or a really hard time. This could have been three months or three weeks. Somebody's trying to figure out what they're going to do or where they're going to go. I really don't want to take all these cards. But we have your poverty house, bad health, thoughts, privileged lady, and mature woman. No, these motherfuckers didn't. Somebody could have tried to take your inheritance or something that was left to you or given to you. Somebody could also be leaving and divorcing a woman, divorcing the whole damn family. Because I feel like they did not only were they married to this woman, they had to marry the whole damn family in a sense. Somebody could have tried to place so, so many things are so stressful on this person's body. Somebody's body is starting to give out or wear out. Somebody can be sick here. I'm definitely getting like somebody stayed somewhere until their mother or their father or their grandmother passed away. They could have sold the house, let the house go, or the house was actually yours and family members tried to manipulate paperwork or manipulate a situation so that you wouldn't have what is rightfully yours. Somebody tried to place you in poverty.
age age is 31 37 as well as 57 16 46 and 77 could be very significant It's like somebody could have been very sick. Somebody could have rolled out a wheel. Or somebody could have had their, somebody write out a wheel for them while they're on their deathbed or very sick. I feel like your name was in it. But they didn't want you to have what was rightfully yours. I'm definitely getting like somebody could have had to move. Or they lost their house. Or they lost their job. It's like when they cut this people off and this family off. They were cut off from everything else, or they cut everybody else off, or they just said, fuck the whole family, fuck, just throw the whole family away, like, fuck everybody. I'm gonna do this on my own, I'm leaving on my own, and I'm, I'm not taking none of that shit with me, y'all can have all that shit, 06, 06 on the clock. At the bottom of the deck, we have here, false person, yeah, somebody tried to falsify something. This could definitely be falsifying document, document tampering, okay? I picked up on that, um... A week ago, if you want to scroll down, I definitely put that in the caption. Document tampering. I definitely picked up on that. All right. Clearing out some messages for the collective Holy Spirit. We have your change, high honor, and journey. One more message for the collective Holy Spirit, please. Toil and labor, thief and official. Thank you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I said I feel like the, the, uh, you are the rightful owner or the official person here, all right? And there's a thief. They're a goddamn thief. Goddamn criminal. And I didn't say God. I said goddamn criminal. Somebody's a criminal and a thief. They wanted to steal from you or take from you, all right? Goddamn pickpocketer. Somebody was trying to dig in your pockets or this family and this privileged lady could have really been in your pockets. But I feel like when you lost your job, or you like, what is this? They treated you like you weren't nothing. Yes, despair, all right, and concern. It's like this person that they married didn't have their back when they lost everything. Or this person that they were with didn't have their back like how they're supposed to. It's like if I didn't have all this money, if I didn't have all these things, or if I couldn't provide you with all these glitz and this glam, all right? Because I feel like somebody had the basic necessities. They had everything they needed, but they also had the extras too, the trips, the gifts, the, all that. And when somebody wasn't able to provide that and all they could give them was the basic necessities, somebody got mean, they got hasty, they got sneaky, they got deceitful. The family as well as this person started working against this official person, which could be you. However, whatever. But I definitely, I'm definitely getting like somebody could have been stealing from an official person. All right? And putting this person through toil and labor. And, and truth be told, they really should be held in high honor. Did I say 38? Somebody could be between the ages of 22 and 42. I'm being told to pull one of these. Okay. Clearing on this messages for the collective Holy Spirit. What important messages do you have? Somebody could also be a blonde haired woman, a brunette. We have here justice, mm, mm, mm. freedom, and children. Somebody could also have children with this person. And the speaker, somebody won't let their child speak to them, or their child could be telling them about what their mother is doing, or their father is doing behind their back, all right? Something is facts. It's the truth. Whatever this child is speaking or saying, it's the truth. Some they weren't supposed to see, some they weren't supposed to hear, or maybe they were supposed to see it or hear it, or maybe this mother, or this father talks in front of their child like that. Or whatever this child is going back and repeating, that's exactly what they heard. Okay, we have here children, freedom, and justice. Yeah, you're going to receive justice revolving the situation. You definitely freed yourself from these people with this change and this journey releasing all things that attach you and these people together other than the kids all right we have here your life purpose involves helping teaching and healing children we also have here freedom you're free to do what you choose and they don't like that mm, somebody could also be bisexual or gay or lesbian all right because with these dolphins here don't dolphins like they don't they could be male and male or female and female i don't know look it up anyways we have here your career brings fairness and protection to others who need your help. And that's what you were, you were fair, you were just, you were honest, you were helpful, and you were there when they needed you. But when you went into despair, 
when you went into despair, these motherfuckers took what they could get and it's like they wanted to throw you away. Because I'm definitely getting like somebody could have lost something with this I'm not hiring here or could have lost their job, okay? But I feel like this needed to happen so you could see how these people truly feel about you. I'll get you guys some messages from the tarot. It's pretty fucked up. Cause like when the money gone, they gone. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. But they don't know you got destined horizons waiting on you, all right? They don't know you're gonna be held in high honor. You're the official person, not them. I feel like something was rightfully yours and they tried to take it away or somebody has taken it away, but I feel like they're gonna get caught up. Something could be falsified. Documents could be falsified. Your signature could have been forged, okay? Somebody could actually be getting calls from agencies or some shit like that. Somebody got a credit card in your name or some weird ass shit like that. Clearing out some messages for the collective Holy Spirit. We have here high honor, change, official person, journey. Clarify journey, please. Clearing on this messages, 11.31 on the clock. I had to say that because I was being told to say it. I usually don't. Okay, once, and you know my last reading started with the Queen of Wands. Something's very significant about that fiery energy, okay? With this Queen of Wands here in the change, mm, I'm getting like a little spitfire, okay? You could have been cool, cool as a cucumber, laid back. But all of a sudden, you're speaking up and you're saying something. These people are getting nervous, all right? The Two of Cups here with the Page of Cups. I feel like somebody's person or ex-person is very apologetic for the way that they treated you. Because you up and it's stuck. And they, and they, mm -hmm, they should have, they should have stayed down for the crown. Somebody couldn't hold you down. They couldn't hold it down. They couldn't hold it down. And they, and they wishing they would have. Tell me more about this Queen of Wands. The uh, <laughs> the Knight of Pentacles with the nine Knight of Pentacles with the Nine of Pentacles. All right, you were given an opportunity. If something there's an opportunity that was given to you, okay? And I feel like somebody is headed towards that with this nine here, with this nine on the change card, as well as the Nine of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles here. Mm, mm, mm. This is a long time coming. You went through something for a long time with these people. You were dealing with something for a long time with these people. You could have felt like you were alone or you didn't have any help. Somebody could have a chest tattoo, something tattooed here on their chest. That was a snail. Because in my other that is a snail. With the snail here at the bottom of the Nine of Pentacles card. Because I wasn't sure on my other deck if that was really a snail down there. But that is a snail. Okay, with the snail here, as well as the Knight of Pentacles, something took you a long time to get there. It was like what the fuck? The ace of wands. It's like, as soon as you cut these people out, decided to, to make that change and take that journey, things just started, opportunities just started coming for you left and right. That was because the Most High did not want you to share that shit with these goddamn thieves. They didn't want you breaking your back for these motherfuckers. Mm -mm. Don't let them crack the whip on you. Shit. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. High honor. Ace of wands. Somebody appreciates the work you do. You're going to be with somebody that's going to appreciate you for who you are and not for what you have and what you could do for them. And, and thank you. Somebody that's going to match your motherfucking energy. There we go. King of Wands, Queen of Wands, boss. Somebody is their own boss. I feel like they don't need anything that you have and you're not going to need anything that they that they have. But when you two come together, goddamn, hot damn. And somebody's going to be sick. Your ex is sick. This person's going to get caught thieving something's gonna be a fraud somebody's committing fraud somebody's committing fraud somebody's a whole ass fake or the shit is fake or the relationship was never real oh my gosh i don't know what this is but you know how somebody could put a piece of paper at the top of the door and you don't know whether or not somebody came or went that's what i'm getting with this bell on his neck somebody gonna ring the alarm because i've been through this too long but i'll be damned if i see another bitch on your arm like, I don't know what the fuck going on, but I'm definitely getting that. I don't know how else to explain it. It's so crazy. I'm just getting like a ship and anchor. Somebody could love the water, the boats, or sailing, or just being in water, or you could be a water sign. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. The temperance with the Queen of Pentacles, the Ace of Swords. 
Temperance, Ace of Swords, Queen of Pentacles. Mm, 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 mm. The Three of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Somebody could be finding a wife, a husband. You don't necessarily have to marry this person, but I feel like there's a commitment that's going to happen for you. I feel like there's a lot of generational wealth that you're creating that you're going to be able to create and nobody's going to be able to take it away from you. I feel like your ancestors are blocking you. This is the truth here. With the Ace of Swords here, tell me more, Holy Spirit. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and the Temperance. The Nine of Swords. Yeah, somebody's going to be going through turmoil, hurt, suffering, pain. Somebody somebody do not like they self for what they did to you, how they allowed their family to manipulate them. I don't even want to call out no specific sign. But the Devil card here at the bottom of the deck with the Nine of Swords, yeah. Somebody could have to move back home with their parents or move into a smaller place or downsize because you're leaving. There's definitely a codependency here. I feel like the truth is coming out. I'm just getting, don't look under the bed. Look under the bed. See what's under there. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. The Nine of Swords, Temperance, Ace of Swords, Queen of Wands. Clarify the Nine of Swords. Yes, the Moon card. Look, see that. All of what you need to know, okay? I feel like there's a lot of secrets that are being revealed, like... All of what somebody was doing behind your back is finally coming to the light and you're just thanking God that you got the hell out while you still could. You have nothing to give this person. You're on a, you're on a journey. You're, on, you're, you're creating change in your life. It's sad, but it's the gosh damn truth. Somebody's going to be receiving tower after tower after tower for all of what they tried to put you through. All right? Tell me more about this official person, Holy Spirit. We have here the King of Cups and the Two of Pentacles. Yeah, because I feel like it was time for you to put yourself first and sail away from this situation, the Six of Wands. I feel like anything and everything that you touch is going to flourish. It's going to grow. You're going to succeed, all right? You can't lose. You just can't lose. It's impossible. It's impossible for you to lose now. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. so it's like a, a passing the torch or pass the torch. I feel like it's something that you're going to create that you can be able to pass down from generation to generation to generation. And I was getting that with this Queen of Pentacles here, the Justice card as well. Tell me more about this thief, Holy Spirit. Turmoil. I keep saying turmoil. That's actually toil and labor. Clarify toil and labor, thief. Toil and labor and thief. Somebody work really hard. Somebody could have a pet cat as well. Somebody work really hard to take what was yours. You have here the Page of Wands with the Four of Cups at the bottom of the deck. These, they could have been having discussions behind your back, getting up meetings about you without you. How the fuck that work? They're, they're, in, they're in this room. They're in this, whatever they're doing, they're having conversations about you without you. You're nowhere near to defend yourself. Somebody's a goddamn thief. They get out of stuff by lying, manipulating. Like they say a whole bunch of shit just to cover their ass or get out of something. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Page of Wands, Thief, Toil and Labor. Yeah, the Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. With the Seven of Wands in reverse in the Tower. Yeah, like somebody's trying to save face. They're trying to save their ass. They're trying to say they ass. They don't want this tower to come. They don't want this official person to leave them or cut them out of what they... you already been cut out. You're going to be cut out. I'm just letting you know that right now, Cross Watcher. I'm just letting you know. You tried it. You tried it or you, you would succeed and you was getting away with it for so long. You had to know like this shit was going to... I saw something fly and drop. Yeah, I did. It was this. Yeah, the Ten of Cups here with the King... Oh, that was King of Wands go with this Queen of Wands. I must have slid earlier. But with the Ten of Cups here, you tarnish this, okay? You're not going to be able to take from this person anymore. That's their Ten of Cups, their destiny. And you don't deserve it or you shouldn't be a part of it. I don't know why this is significant, but somebody isn't, um, what's the word I want to say? Come come to me now. I ain't got no sons. I ain't got no kids yet. Um, circumcised. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Somebody isn't circumcised. I don't know who that's for. That's for somebody. 
that's a significant detail for somebody. I don't know why I needed to say it, but hey, it is what it is. With the Six of Wands at the bottom of the deck and the Eight of Cups, definitely cut these people out. Somebody tried to cut you out of the wheel that you was already in. I don't know what this is, but somebody did not have a rights to what they thought they had a rights to. All right? And you definitely walked away from this situation. And you walked away victorious. All right? You're creating change. Tell me more about this journey, Holy Spirit, for the collective. Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Journey. Once again, the Eight of Cups. Taking the journey, all right? You go from the eight to the nine to the ten. You walk your own path and you dance to your own beat of your drum. Somebody could have beautiful dresses. They could wear beautiful dresses or nice. You're very well put together. You're a very attractive woman or man. Very attractive. And it's like whatever you've been through or whatever you've gone through, people wouldn't even guess that you've been through what you've gone through. If like if you told the people the shit, the type of shit that you've been through and the lifestyle that you had, the things you had to endure, they wouldn't believe it because you wear the shit so well. They would not believe it. I feel like all these endings had to happen for a reason so that you can flourish and you can have a new beginning, okay? I really do believe that. The two of swords here with the six of pentacles, there's no more. There's going to be no more of people fighting over something that is rightfully yours, okay? And you're not even knowing about it. I feel like somebody could have been asking somebody, when are you going to get him to do this? Or I don't know why I'm getting him. When are you going to get him to do this? Or when are you going to get her to do that so we can? It's like people, somebody that you could have been in a partnership with, in a relationship with, could have been plotting on your destiny your money your finances your life your career your growth just whatever taking advantage of a situation plotting on something that was yours with someone else getting four to three people could have been involved i put one <laughs> four to three people could have been involved anything else for the collective holy spirit the knight of cups and the full card yeah expect for these people to be asking for your forgiveness I wanted to try to um, come back into your life, all right? I don't, yeah, you're, you're definitely moving on. Use your intuition when dealing with these people. Please use your intuition and allow your intuition to guide you, okay? With this full card here and the six of swords, because you're definitely moving on to calmer waters, and you don't got the fuck time for these people. I really hope this helped. Be sure to take only what resonates and leave the rest. I'm sending you the utmost 2244 on the clock. I'm sending you the utmost love and respect, peace, healing, joy, prosperity, love, and hell of that shit. Peace.